everyone, my name is Tessa Emily Hall. I am 20 years old and I am the author of Purple Moon. It's a YA Christian fiction novel published by Lighthouse Publishing of the Carolinas. A question I get asked pretty frequently is how did you become published at such a young age? Today I want to be discussing a little bit about my writing journey so far, how I became published, and how you become published as well. When I first started out, I was only 14 years old. Keep in mind that if you're wanting to become a teenage author, you're going to have to make some sacrifices. And for me, those sacrifices including not attending school from 9th through 11th grade, I homeschooled, missing out on a lot of teenage experience, having to stay home some weekends in order to write my book. However, if you're willing and your passion for writing is big enough, I say go for it. Just keep in mind that there are sacrifices that you're going to have to make. When I was 14, I knew I wanted to write Christian fiction books for teenagers, but I actually didn't even know that the genre existed. One day, I decided to Google Christian books for teenagers. I was so happy to find a, a list of several YA Christian fiction books, mostly written by Melody Carlson. In the next few months, I devoured her books, and I just read several books in the genre that I wanted to write. I also had to do a ton of research on the craft of writing. I actually had no idea how the publishing process worked. I started following several industry blogs, took a course through the Christian Writers Guild, and I started reading several books on the writing craft. When people ask me how they can begin their publishing journey, I always tell them the three things that they need to do. Read. Read as many books in your genre as you can get your hands on. Research. Research the writing craft. Understand how the publishing process works. Just really study how to write fiction. Write. Um, obviously, that is the most important. You need to write as much as you can and as often as you can. Five minutes a day is better than nothing. I also advise that you set goals for yourself and reward yourself whenever you meet those goals. Ask yourself where you would like to be in the next five years. Do whatever you can to get to that point. I always have to remind myself that prayer, perseverance, and passion always pays off. When you feel that your manuscript is ready, meaning you've written your first draft and you've edited it so that it's as strong as possible, I highly recommend that you attend a writer's conference. At a writing conference, you're able to learn more about the craft, network with other writers, and pitch your proposal to editors or agents. I actually met my publisher at the first writing conference that I attended. I also met my agent at a conference as well. I just want to say one last thing. Try not to rush the process. Even if you don't get published as a teenager, it's not the end of the world. You have the rest of your life to pursue writing. It really shouldn't be about age, but about experience. When I got my first contract, I was 16 years old. I didn't sign it until I was 17. Even after that, I continued learning more about the writing craft. I actually didn't send my manuscript into my editor until I was 18. And so that's why my book didn't get published until I was 19. If you want to really make a good impression with your debut novel, I suggest taking as long as you can. Try your best not to rush the process. Let me know if you have any questions. I'll try my best to answer them in my next videos. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you all have a blessed day.